Hi guys, uh, <laughs> so what is today? Good God, it is uh, Monday, July 18th, 2022, so uh, I was up uh, at Sister Sandy's last night, and unfortunately, uh, we missed this uh, new video from Michael Dowd. Uh, I don't talk about brother Michael Dowd much on this channel for for all kinds of reasons <clears throat> but anyway so uh, I want to appreciate a, I want to thank realize 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 for bringing for bringing this attention this video to my attention uh, about Dowd on McPherson so uh, this is uh, Michael Dowd uh, if you haven't heard the video, go ahead. I, I made it, how far did I? I made it 11 minutes into it before I, I, I had uh, <laughs> heard, heard enough. So anyway, I really uh, in, enjoyed this part. Uh, so 11 and a half minutes into it, uh, Michael lets us know uh, you know, he's talking about uh, why uh, Michael Dowd, why the the famous Guy McPherson interview has never uh, shown up on uh, Michael Dowd's channel. I'm uh, I'm trying to remember when uh, Michael Dowd interviewed Sam Mitchell at Collapse Chronicles, uh, I know we talked, I, I honestly can't remember what uh, Michael's uh, opinion, off-the-record opinion of Guy McFry, I honestly can't remember. I do remember the only ground rules I had in that interview. I told Michael there are two subjects I will not discuss in the Collapse Chronicles interview, uh, and that was I was not going to discuss Guy McPherson or Hambone Littletail, that those two subjects were off the table, and so I remember that, so uh, you will certainly, I don't even know, I, I, I have no idea uh, with my history with with Michael Dowd, whether that fucking video of uh, of Sam Mitchell from Collapse Chronicles is even up there, but anyway, that they so I don't know how many people uh, Michael is uh, interviewed now. He has clearly uh, surpassed me or uh, Sam Mitchell or or even Guy McPherson in the number of people he's interviewed. Uh, but so he was answering the question, why has he never interviewed Guy McPherson? Well, the reason it wasn't for lack of trying, as Michael says, uh, that so Michael apparently three times uh, invited Guy to come on the show. And the first two times he got a polite no thank you and the third time. So the first time he invited Guy, Guy responded, this is June of 2019, thank you for the invitation. However, I will not participate in a conversation involving people who defame me. Your list includes several. Sincerely, Guy. And then uh, in December 2019, uh, he put, I count at least 20 people who have betrayed, plagiarized, or defamed me. No thanks. And then in January 2021, when Michael tried a third time to uh, get Guy McPherson on his show, uh, Guy responded back, Michael, I suspect you continue to, to defame me overtly or subtly. I suspect you continue to downplay the importance of the aerosol masking effect. I assume you 
continue to deny the relevance of nuclear power plants melting down, I will not participate in a call of any kind with you. I do not wish to risk further defamation. You have done too much of that already. And so I guess you can go on Michael's uh, video over on his channel to hear his comments to those videos. But uh, here was the... <laughs> Here was the com uh, the comment from uh, Humpty Dumpty Tribe. This was Hambon Little Tail's comments, uh, which I notice I have received no comment back. I don't even know if this comment has been pulled down, or I don't even know if the comment is up or not. So my my comment to uh, to Michael. <coughs> I am so proud to be a, on a long and growing list of woke doomers that convinced Guy McPherson not to talk to you. I wear that as a badge of honor, as you should, to the degree that you have ever defamed this idiot who needs no help in being defamed, as he himself is the master of defaming himself. Every time he opens his mouth, Guy and his little deep pockets sugar tit sidekick have dedicated their puny little pathetic lives to defaming me. Like Guy, Hambone Littletail needs nobody's help in defaming himself, and that little eco pussy over there at Collapse Chronicles, and yet we are both still here. Although judging by your view count as compared to ours, clearly we have passed the baton of doom over to you and Guy. On a more serious note, as I have been saying for years, I have nothing but gratitude for Guy McPherson, who has done more for my floundering, decomposing YouTube career than anybody in the world. Without his tireless efforts to keep promoting my work, there would no doubt not even be a Humpty Dumpty Tribe or Collapse Chronicles. And then, of course, we hear from Collapse Chronicles, McPherson who? Never heard of the guy. And then uh, there's this long comment. I'm not going to get into it because I really... I mean, you can find it on here, uh, and he's probably listening to. So realize, realize, realize. <laughs> uh, he he leaves a great comment, and uh, and and uh, I love Michael Dowd. So you can uh, you you can find realize, realize, realize this. Uh, you can go read that yourself in Michael's comment. I don't know if Michael Dowd or uh, or Guy McPherson know or give a shit that realize, 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 and I are, are good buddies and, and housemates. Uh, anyway, oh, here's Philip Stone, no comment. But, uh, of course, here we hear from, uh, good God, uh, we hear from, what is she calling herself here? Where, oh, Pauline Project Love. Uh, anyway, she writes a damn book of a comment. And I notice Sancho Panza, Sancho Panza re uh, replying to, uh, Sancho Panza replying to Pauline Love. I still think of you and that night in the mud hut every time I hump my pillow. So that is Sancho uh, Ponza's <laughs> comment to Polly. But anyway, I am so happy to see that uh, that uh, Michael Dowd is... Uh, I, well... Michael, have you given up? I, I guess Michael has finally thrown in the towel on ever getting Guy McPherson uh, on his show. I, I don't have any clue why Michael Dowd would want to uh, hear one fucking word Guy McPherson has to say about anything. But uh, 
that's Michael Dowd's business. So nanny nanny boo boo, Michael. I got uh, Guy McPherson on Humpty Dumpty try, but of course I had to go to the mud hut to do it. So uh, maybe if you show up at uh, in Vermont and knock on and knock on Guy and Pauline's door, maybe he'll talk to you. Anyway. Oh, it is time for a margarita. I just love all the Doomer drama. Gotta love the Doomer drama. My God.